Hey, what's going on guys? Coming back to you with another video this week. Out here on my daily little walk outside, getting this energy from the sun, getting all this, you know, like I say, vitamin D, no homo, of course. But I wanna to talk to you today about the main reason why people feel like their life sucks so bad. And a majority of people, their life does suck because they have no purpose in life, no, no type of grind at all to their being. But the main, I'm gonna give you three reasons on why your life is trash. As a, the main one, probably the most important one right now is that majority of people are just lazy. They're lazy pieces of shit. They don't do anything besides if they even work, you know, they go to work, they come home, sit on the couch, eat a pack of Doritos, eat McDonald's every day. And being lazy is probably the most cardinal sin you can have as a young man, as a young woman too, like that. You gotta take care of your physical, physical body because if you think about it, you only get one physical body in this world the older you get, the more time you go without exercising, building some muscle, uh, cardiovascular health and all that. The more time you go without working on that, the harder it gets on you. You get older, you start adding more weight onto your frame. It becomes harder on your joints, your body, your energy levels are already going to be trash if you're out of shape. But the older you get, your energy levels go down. It becomes a lot harder to get off of work, go straight to the gym, go do something. It gets even harder, so you become complacent with life. You end up just saying, oh well, uh, maybe getting in shape isn't worth it. Maybe me going to the gym is, isn't worth it because it's not gonna change anything. But that's not true, guys. Like I always say, you can legit change your life with just the choice to like, hey man, today I'm gonna stop being a lazy piece of shit. I'm gonna go sign up for the gym. I know New Year's resolutions passed and it's not popular to go and sign up now, but Make the choice, man. Just go sign up. Hit it a couple times a week. I guarantee you will feel better. I guarantee it. You'll feel better. You'll be a little more confident with yourself. And then it becomes an addiction. Once you see your body change a little bit, it becomes almost like a game. It's like, damn, let me see how far I can take this. Let me see what my physical capabilities in life are. But that's number one. Number two is you live life with, I know the sun is really bright, so you might not be able to see me very well. <laughs> number two is you live life with no kind of purpose no kind of purpose in life like i said you go to work you come home there's nothing there uh, you as a young person mainly young men you have to have some kind of purpose in life what are you providing to yourself your loved ones the people around you your community you know you got to be able to have some kind of drive in something so like say for example like with martial arts i love to be a coach that's kind of what i feel like my purpose is is to be able to share the knowledge of what i do and what i love with other people help them better themselves gain more confidence be healthy learn some self-defense stuff like that because it can go a long way another person let's relate it back to martial arts again their purpose might be Wow, I can maybe change my life and change this, chase this as a profession. I can do this as a profession, you know, earn some good money, change the life of my family, my loved ones, the people around me. And you know, a lot of people, a lot of people, I keep looking back just to make sure I don't get run over by a car. But um, <laughs> a lot of people, they need that kind of hero in their life, you know? There's not a lot of people willing to take the risk to, better themselves they're too complacent in life they're scared of making a change that can honestly maybe make or break them but you know what they say no risk no reward <clears throat> and the third reason a lot of people's life is trash is they're stuck at like a, a dead end kind of position like say their job doesn't pay much of anything at all you know you gotta but yeah, anyways back to what i was saying my, my camera acted up for some reason but yeah um your finances you know 
that uh puts a lot of stress on on you like because financial security is probably one of the more important things in life it's not the most important thing but it's, it's pretty important you want to be able to provide for like i said yourself mainly of anything but if you have a girlfriend a wife uh, children you know um, I mean, your girlfriend and your wife can provide for herself too, but mainly if you have like kids or family members that can't work and all that, you have to be able to provide for them. And that's also relating to purpose too, right there. I mean, if you're put in that position where you have people counting on you, that's your purpose in life right there. Your purpose is to provide for them, teach them, kind of guide them through life and kind of teach them from the perspective of all the mistakes that you've made in life. You want to kind of guide people in not making the same mistakes that you made even though mistakes are the most valuable learning lesson you can have because if you don't fail countless times you don't learn if you succeed yeah you kind of learn from succeeding but it's not like a, a failure a failure will teach you so many life lessons like kind of like i was related shit back to fitness and martial arts all that if you win a fight that means you did a lot of things correct in your training camp and the actual fight, the way you initiated your game plan and everything. But if you take a loss, that'll do a lot of things to you. That'll change you. That'll keep you up at night training when other people are sleeping. That'll make you train six, seven days a week while other people are only training three or four times. Man, a loss will really, really, really change you, man. That car coming. Make sure I don't get run over. But I'll hand it up. Anyways. <laughs> A loss could change you, man. Just like a loss of anything in life. A loss of your job. A loss of a loved one. Everything like that. God, why is everybody home? Everybody's supposed to be gone. But yeah, guys. I'm just on my, you know, little little rant. I hope you all stay around listening to me. But, um, everybody and their grandma out today. Everybody should be at work. <laughs> but yeah, guys. I'm glad y'all stick around. If y'all have stood around this long listen to me talk you know i just try to put out these like weekly videos of me just kind of giving life advice and kind of telling y'all the perspective from my life and all the lessons that i've learned in my life but yeah keep on the lookout for more videos like this um don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel if you haven't i greatly appreciate it stay guys work hard stay humble let's get after it okay see y'all next time